Hello there everyone and thank you for joining me at the start of a new campaign in Old World Blues, our A to Z series, which we're playing right now as the Bumblebees. But we are currently at war. We're not, this is not the beginning of the campaign, but we basically have gone through some of the focuses, the normal uh, stuff for the generic focus trees, which come more stability, research speed, research slot, um, arms workshops, we're doing recruit caravan guards. But we're getting attacked by this group from Nordicon, and we seem to be holding out, well, okay for now. No guarantee that we'll be perfect here, but oh, they're actually attacking us over there too. So, um, we're here grinding out what, uh, well, their bodies. We're out of manpower, which is not a really good thing for us at all, you know. Uh, Some one guy up here maybe as well, but uh, so this campaign we're a bunch of busy bees. We wanted to go to war with Ant, I think, or somebody. Are we just fighting anybody? I think we canceled it. Might be because these guys went to war with us, so we don't want to have a two front war probably. But in the meantime, we'll probably get to waste some militias because we definitely need more uh, political power uh, to get more population. But hey, it's good for uh, experience, I'd say that, definitely. Uh, let's grab some of that. That'd be very nice. Alamo chapter. Uh, yeah, you probably want to move back there. Ooh. Now they're taking on all fronts. That's not ideal. But these guys. Ooh. Recruit caravan guards are good. We're going to go with hard gunsmiths so we can make more weapons. That was really my goal here. Militia commanders, militia drills, plan a wall. Uh, there are some gunsmiths, probably. You want to, read, want to read that? Please go right ahead. Ooh, two is not good. How many? We need more manpower, of course. We need more guns, though, too. So I don't know how long we can really hold out here. Oh, now they're forcing attack. That's not ideal. Quite not ideal. I kind of wonder if we could just, like, go and attack them, but... We have the river to hold on to, so we're probably not going to do that. And we can only get 1.42 political power every day. So we're led by the bumblebee. Core function, construction, habitation. Urban infrastructure as well as industrial and commercial. Historic note. Working hard on expanding her own kingdom and working hard. Coldly treated subjects. A cruel monster. Or master. Capital Hill's gone. But we have, have never seen. We lose monthly population, stability, and appeal to refugees. But uh, we do have better consumer goods. Uh, we get more construction speed and factory output. We have clean water. We have a scav we are a scavenger city. We're wealthy because we work so hard. We have new schools and we've erected a palisade, which is not bad. But we're gonna go grab some more manpower right now. Because my god, do we need it? You know, grab even more manpower. My god, do we need it? <laughs> up and out up there. In the meantime, conventional warfare, so we get even more max entrenchment and entrenchment speed. Research, yeah, we'll go with that one for now. And we'll also hit this one too. That's supply usage we good. Gliders are nice. Um, research speed, yeah, go grab that. And we probably want a new commander here. Raphael Jackson, yes. You'll also be inspirational for now. He's got some tight nuts, though. Alright, so he gets plus 25% leader experience gain. That's actually pretty good. Pretty darn decent. Song from the front of you, we're gonna forget about that place. We're gonna go with, uh, I want more for the power, but Warspar will help us on defense. Just a little bit more on core territory, so. Head on in. But yeah, we definitely need more guns. We're gonna get some special forces equipment, guns, you know, all the like. That's why we're going down with higher gunsmiths and uh, subsidizing many weapons manufacturers. If you want to read about that one, please go ahead. It's only 10%, but 10% is better than nothing. And we'll probably honestly go with uh, establishing armory as well. And for us, we'll probably do plant a wall. Additionally, with finalize the defenses, which we can get to. We could really use that division up right now. But we don't have it. So we're gonna give this one for more output. So you're actually level three already. He's gonna be a winter specialist, that's pretty nice. He's almost level four, nice. Good, our gunsmiths. That should help us out with another pipe cut factory. And we have a total of what? 82%. Chem's bad. No undesirables. No mutants allowed. Work is needed. Oh, we're gonna grab this one too. Get more experience gain. Ooh, he must have leveled up. I love it. Alright, so Ninja. I like recruitment, but I also like this one, Life Giver, just because uh, it gives you more organization and less experience soldiers' losses, and we are out of experience. Or, like, losing less people is good. And then, gives more organization is always very good as well. So, you are going to do what? Beloved leader? Or you have more organization? 
Um, Behemoth, infantry, 5% more attack. I'm not sure which one's more organization. Let's just go with straight up more attack and defense. I usually do that one because it's pretty reliable and that's pretty standard for throughout everything we use. So, uh, we get a scavenging program. We can do that too. What else do we want to do? Propaganda efforts, not always bad to do. And. Hmm. So he's a patriotism. Oh, that's different. He was a craft and a war support, though. For weekly manpower. Could use more stability, but. Ooh, not doing so well right there. Ooh, we don't have the army speed for that. Because these guys. We start with network guards with militia, and I don't like militia. Those guys are only 12 combat width. What am I going to do with that? Start increasing their size immediately. Because right now, where are we at? We've lost 77 versus 400 some. These guys are relatively strong. They do have quite a few bonuses to them. They have quite a bit of manpower. Uh, quite a few divisions, but we'll be here for a while doing all this stuff. <coughs> but we'll see it's selecting a little more manpower. It's always oh, very good too. As long as we keep attacking us, we keep increasing our size. That's what really matters. In the meantime, Caravan Gar, that'd be pretty good to do. More attack and defense would help us out immediately too. Kind mercenary is not bad. Ooh, that's really good. More organization as well. But we already grabbed the political power person here. Town defender. Bumblebees. It sounds like that would be for bumblebees. So we'll probably do this one. More defense. Um, we probably want to go to something like this. Every cap for the army. Need more wall attention. Well, we'll probably save that for every cap for the army then. We also got the golden gecko. Mm, faithful henchman, huh? Here. Send you over there. And just option armor for another uh, military factory? Pretty much. We need to, we will increase um, that. But, what do we want? Recon. We don't have any recon on our guys yet. Experience gain is good. Division recovery time is good. Training time I don't really care about. I kind of want more organization, even though Daniel Hath would be pretty decent for damage garrisons too. The Faithful Henchman. It's not bad. Compliance growth speed could be pretty decent again. And I usually choose someone like that. Warmonger. We probably honestly need, need that guy. We are bees. Let's get Adam Travis. Just because we, we want to reproduce. Right? Strong's nice. Very nice. Still out of gun, but we're fixing that right now. They are slowly beating us here. Not ideal. Level 5 already, good. But we'll be doing this for a while. Establish an armory, militia commanders like normal. If you want to read these, please go ahead. Uh, militia drills, militia organization, militia recruitment posters, center of the community. Um, maybe waste on setters arrive, potato farmers, as well as Brahmin herders. But not to mention, political reorganization. Ah, now this is a real war we wanted. Uh, Bumblebees versus the Yellow Jackets. So we took out Nordicon, which was very, very annoying. I'll be honest, very incredibly annoying. But uh, we'll see if we can actually break over here. We should be able to overall, uh, especially because there's a waterway right here, which sucks. But we do have a cup of uh, some double chai spiced tea. To keep us nice and warm. Uh, can we pierce their armor? Uh, not really. Somewhat, but we definitely could use some anti tank. Um, over here, we're doing okay with all that stuff. We got some of that anti tank stuff, but we definitely need to put more on it on. More of it on. Um, and, oh, we couldn't quite break through. Come on. There goes zero. That's oh, just dropping like crazy. Just kind of like their strength. It's good to see that, though. Oh. Put through another division, which sucks. Interesting, the organization doesn't drop nearly as hard now. Okay, so now we got over there, which is good. Uh, special forces, we'd like to go over there, but can't quite do that yet. Oh, they're attacking us too. Alright. Sounds perfect for us. And we did put, throw some planes on our guys as well, so I actually have carrier fight not carriers. They do have, uh, what do we have? Doing any damage at all? Maybe, maybe not? No? Well, they should be doing some sort of damage. There we go. Now I'm finally doing some damage. Um, I wonder if we just take Brad Creek. Is that really all we need? It's probably all we need, really. Nice. Just go and destroy him. That's good. That's very good. 
Just go in. Take pretty much take everybody, but like one division of you guys to help attack there. They can move around. I don't really care. Nice. It'll be quite the struggle, but that's okay. You know what? Don't let them move. We don't like it when they squirm or move around. Force defense. Now that's pretty bold. And uh, there you go. In the meantime, after them, mosquitoes. Mosquitoes seem like a good group we should probably take out. We will need to course some of the territory. We're definitely in no shape to do so right now, but that's okay. But we can probably grab some outsider battalions for more compliance, more non-core manpower. That'd be probably pretty good overall. Couch though, 28 versus 350. That's not bad. Um, let's come over here. Anything else we really care about right now? Not too much, no. And we're doing okay overall. Not great, not bad. Just okay, really. Realm of the Sister... Sister Gods. Doing a decent amount of damage, actually, with just regular uh, biplanes or fighters. Gliders. Nice. Standardized tools. Good. Going to do that one. Tactical map awareness. Map. Tactical awareness and map overlapping. Getting some marching drills would be good as well. Another special forces. Nice. Good. That's very good. Exactly what we want to see. What's next? Yellow jacket. Oh, less than 200 manpower. The equipment wise, they're not doing too poorly, but the manpower. We hope it keeps dropping. Keep those guys in place. We've almost got them. We're gonna force it. Screw it. Just go in like this. You'll be fine. Focus fire is good. Get some more recon on you guys. Because that's automatically just applied and upgraded to uh, division screwing in the field. I'll grab one too. Reno's and jackals. Come on. I know there's cycling more divisions in and out here all the time, but like, bruh. Good. There's a lot of factories we could use there. Nice. Go and grab that one, too. Good. A lot of couch tees. You know, somewhat. Ooh, they're doing force defense as well, huh? Are we missing anything? We are missing portable radios and demo equipment. Which, you know, makes sense. Aggressive honeybees, huh? Come on. Should have had it by now. Drop some more coordination because you can. Five. Still struggling down here too. It makes sense. Special forces are really hurting. It's good to see that. Come on. Our guys are really hurting too. You hold. You get some more organization, then you'll just reattack them later. Um, political reorganization. Just have trade routes. That'd be good. Go ahead. You can hold now too. Just give a little more time because I'll throw more guys in here. Oh god, we were so close. Force it. Another one of these guys, good. Wow, this is taking way too long. How are you level 5 with level 8? Skill 8, supply consumption. Like, bruh. That literally makes no sense to me. This is so stupid. I'll grab that too. For now. They're always so very close. They just never break. This sucks. This really does suck. I mean, this is so stupid. They really need to buff infantry. 
Come on. How do you have not anything else? All you have is skill and like supply. Especially when they're out of manpower too. Just doesn't make any sense. Because we're not fighting over a river. Special forces are here, and they're pretty thick as well. 18 combo with, yep. I made sure we had good stuff. And even our planes can't do anything about these guys. More damage. Force it, force it, force it, force it. Come on. We were so close. We were 95. You're not dropping them hard enough, in all honesty. Oh, they're doing force defense. That's good to see. Good. Establishing trade routes. Trade laws. Yeah, we can use more of that too, probably. Marapa would be very nice too. A full strength. There's no way you have a full strength special forces division. Literally no way. Prove radar. Uh -huh. Bumblebees. It, we could drop frag grenades. I could probably drop them. Roll that one. We actually won down here, wow. Ah, uh, let's go with this one. I have nothing to think about. We actually won down here, look at that. That's so bad. Look how weak their special forces are. Literally just demolish them. Collecting that political power. You guys are gonna force it now too. Thank God. I'm sorry. That just took way too long. A thousand losses for nothing. Go in. Screw them up. And now we wasted all that political power. I might just give myself 18 more political power in the end of this. Cause that's just stupid. That's incredibly stupid. Lost a thousand versus they really should be ten thousand at least. Come on. Come on, you're fighting over help them out. Bumblebees are not easy to play as. Those are saying, how much money do we have? Oh, it's not bad. Green solicitations, it's not bad. Oh, it's a state funded radio programming. More political power, weekly stability. I kind of like that. Ooh. Do those two radar stations? Okay, whatever. Develop roadways, plan for infrastructure, Brahmin herders, why not? Come on, you should be done by now. If everyone has to force it, this will be it. Should have been done by now. There you go. <clears throat> and a little ahead of time. It's a little ahead of time, but that one's fine to do. There you go. I'm sorry that took so long, but that's pissing me off way too much. But we'll start the next episode. We'll probably go to war with Mosquito. So I don't think this will be a very long campaign, but that's just me. If you enjoyed the video, though, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. And I'll see you tomorrow as we we'll continue trying to figure out what we can do with a bumblebee. Thanks for watching. Have a great ins insect rest of your day.